Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I am Kaylee and in today's video, I am cash stuffing the money from my second December paycheck. So let's just get right into it. Also, this is a new setup. Let me know if you guys like it or if you prefer my old one. So we're just gonna start by counting this money. So we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 260, 70, 80, 90, 300, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 400, <clears throat> 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. So we have $431 here. So I'm just going to put this on the tray. All right, so first and foremost, I'm gonna grab my coin jar and I'm just gonna stuff the coins that I have into here. So this is what I have. It's gonna be a little loud. That actually was not as loud as I was expecting. <laughs> All right, so we're making some progress. I think I might cash this out. Um, and then like start again for the new year so I can see how much I save in one year. And you get a new um, flower pot for this little flower I got. I actually got that from, I went on a vacation to Delaware with my boyfriend for our anniversary and I went to this really beautiful place called Longwood Gardens where they had, um, it was obviously a garden, but it's really cold out so it was like Christmassy themed and it was really nice and I bought a flower for my mom and I also bought that for myself. Anyways, now that I'm rambling, I'm just gonna get started with my daily variable expense wallet. So some of these I already spent out of because I normally would have cash stuffed yesterday, but I was still on my vacation yesterday. So we're gonna start with gas. Gas is getting $40, so just two 20s. And that's because I spent the rollover that I had. If you watched my last video, and I also spent $10 out of this week's party. So $40 in gas. Groceries is getting 75, so 50, 70, and a five. So how have you guys been doing? It's almost Christmas. It's the week of Christmas as I'm filming this. I guess it's the, what the 21st and this is the first day of winter as well. I feel like it's been winter forever where I live though. Dining. So I did spend a little bit out of this already. So it's getting a weird amount. It's getting 62. So 20, 40, 60, one, and two. I was talking to my boyfriend and in the new year, he was like, yeah, next year is our year. And I was like, yes, it is. So we're going to be cutting back on our spending next year. And miscellaneous, I did spend a little bit out of here as well, so it's getting $12. I'm going to just film all of my binders in this video. We're going to see how long it is, and if you guys prefer the shorter ones, just let me know, because I can do that. Alright, now we're going to get into my bills, which is my pink binder. All right, so car insurance, this is getting 25, so 20 and a five. Now it has 20, 40, 45, 50, so it is fully funded for January. I'm finally getting my nails done this weekend, thank God. Phone bill is also getting 25, so 20. So 20, 40, 45, 50, fully funded for January. Amazon Prime is getting $5. So now it has 
oh god 20 30 40 45 dollars Next up is Xbox Live. It is fully funded and I took the money out to pay for it. Then we have Curology. This is getting $10. So we have 50, 60, 70, $80, which is enough for my next um, subscription when I want to order it. Retirement, this always gets prop money because it just gets put into my savings. I already put it in here. So retirement house 100, 200, 220, 230, 235. And the next one is invest. Um, it just has 30. I don't really feel like counting it. <laughs> so that's it for my bills. Next up is my sinking funds. And this is a new, oh God, this is a new one. My boyfriend got me this for Christmas. I think it's just so cute. And it has one of these like, I don't know what they're called, button. I don't know. I like these ones better because I feel like they can hold more. All right, so for sinking funds, first up we have Buffer. And Buffer is getting $10, so now it has $20. Car maintenance, so this one, if you watched my budget with me, I upped this to 200, so I just put the prop money in here, the rest of it is in the bank now. So it's technically this isn't getting anything stuffed into it. It's already there. <laughs> Electronics, this is a new one. It is getting $10, oh God, it's getting $10. We'll find out if that's wrong. Gifts is getting $5. Now gifts is not for Christmas anymore. You'll see later in this video, I have a holiday binder now. Gifts is just for anything besides Christmas, really. All right, nails is getting $10. And it really, oh my God, all of my zippers are out of whack. It's getting $10. So now it has 10, 20, 30, 40, $50. It low key didn't even really need it. I'm just saving up for the next, next appointment now. Because to get my fill, it will not be more than $40. Other, so this is for anything other than a specified envelope. It's getting $10. So now it has 20, just kind of like a miscellaneous for shopping. Squish, this is for my squishmallows. And it is getting $10. Super excited about this envelope, guys. <laughs> Sway, that is my boyfriend. He is getting $10. So now he has $20. You can tell most of my sinking funds got $10 this paycheck. <laughs> Tattoo is getting $5. So now we have 50, 70, 80, 85 in tattoo. And finally, we have a vacation, which is getting $25. So we have 20 and 5. So we have 100, 200 in the bank. 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. So $250 in vacation. And I did also get rid of my fun envelope, which is what I just spent everything out of. So it was completely empty anyways. But I did just get rid of it because I'm going to kind of combine it into vacation. I'm just going to start stuffing more into there. So that is everything out of my sinking funds. Next, we're going to do my holiday binder. This will be my first time stuffing into here. And I do have a little cheat sheet in the back for how much each thing gets, you know, each week. So I'm probably gonna, I'm just gonna grab this out and put it on the side so I can look at it. Because I'm not used to stuffing this quite yet. All right, let me get comfortable. <laughs> I don't know why none of my binders stay down. All right, Valentine's Day is getting $15, so at 10 and a five. I don't, my denominations again aren't exactly correct. So we're just going with the flow. 
Halloween is getting five dollars, and that's my last five, so I just gotta hope for the best now from here on out. Candle Day, which is for Bath and Body Works Candle Day, is getting ten dollars. Black Friday is getting ten dollars. Oh god. December 19th, which is my anniversary, which just passed, is getting 15. One, two, three, four, five. And Christmas is getting $20. And that is everything out of my holiday envelope. All right, guys, so I'm realizing that I did mess up. So I actually didn't go to the bank for this money. I had a little bit of money in my house that I had to deposit. And then the rest of it, um, since my mom also does cash envelope budgeting, I was like, you take this out of my account and we'll like do some trade-offs. And I had a feeling it wasn't gonna work and it didn't because I'm supposed to have $130 left. $128, I think actually. And I have um, like $8 here. So, I did just go out and unfortunately I'm going to have to go back out again in order to do my savings challenges. But it's okay. So is life, I suppose. Um, I guess I'll just do what I can here and then maybe I'll make like a short video. I don't know. So I can't do anything in this, which is what I was the most excited for. But actually, oh... Also, I'm just going to get rid of my Star Notes envelope. I looked up and none of these have any value. And I realized it is actually pretty rare for them to have any value because they do print quite a lot of them. So I'm just going to put this towards other savings challenges. So don't hate me for that. I'm starting my 26 week challenge in January. I also said I was going to start these all in um, January, but I'm starting them already. So in here, I have my three challenges from one frugal introvert, and I was, I guess, I'm just going to, I don't know, because I don't have all the money that I was expecting to have. Let me grab a marker, and I guess I'll start coloring in. In my $63 savings challenge, I'm going to put... We're gonna put five dollars. So let me color that in. All right, that was a pretty dull marker, so it kind of made it difficult. So in my, you know what? I'm just gonna do this one for now. I'm just going to put it in like this so that I know that it's for that challenge. Exciting! This is my first time doing like savings challenges like this. So exciting. Alright. And these are going to get a little bit more. So I just stuffed five, right? So two, three, four, five. Um, I guess I'm going to take out $120. I'm going to go to the bank now, I guess, and do that. Just so you guys know, I was supposed to be stuffing $128 in a year, but when can I ever have a cash stuffing that's not absolutely chaotic? Just my life, I guess. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to put two, three, four. I'm going to do, hmm, I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna do $5 into my $1 savings challenge, which already has a dollar in here. Isn't that great? I'm just not gonna count it, but we already know it's at six. <laughs> All right, and then in this one, start date. I don't even know what, I 
think today is, I said what the date was earlier, didn't I? It's, oh God, the 21st of 2022. Great. I'm gonna put, what color should I put that one? Maybe pink. This one is, is um, sharper, so it should work. I have $12 left, I'll put that in here. Nice, nice, nice. Oh God, I already colored out of the lines. So emo guys, I can't do this. <laughs> That's something I've been saying lately. Every time like I get upset about something, I'm just like, I'm so emo. <laughs> People are always like, okay. <laughs> I suck at coloring. All right, so my last $12, which shouldn't even be my last, but it's fine. We're not gonna get into it. Whatever, I'm not upset, guys. <laughs> All right, sorry that it was, um, again, a fail. My first ever stuffing savings challenges and I, I cronked it up already. It's fine, guys. You know what sucks is when I disappoint myself with how these cash stuffings go, is I don't get to do it again for another like two and a half weeks. So, whatever. It's fine, but other than the chaoticness of the end, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please do consider liking, commenting, subscribing if you did enjoy. Let me know how you like the new background. Um, if you did make it this far, comment a pink flower emoji for my new little friend I have here. She's so pretty and cute, but yeah, I will see you guys in the next video then. Stay safe and have a great week and a happy holiday. Bye-bye.